Hi boys and girls, it's Miss Nina. How are you doing today? I hope everybody is still staying safe and being healthy and staying indoors and having lots of fun at home, finding some good activities to do. So today, boys and girls, we are going to be doing a journal writing topic, okay? So I came up with a really good topic to write about, okay? And this one is going to be about the beach, okay? So I want you to get comfortable, okay, in your favorite chair, in your favorite uh, maybe spot in your room, okay? And um, I want us to do a little thinking exercise, okay, first, before we start writing, okay? Now, the way I do this thinking exercise is I want us to be in a nice, calm area where there's not too much noise and it's very quiet and calm, okay, so we can think, okay? And you're going to close your eyes, okay, right now, okay? So I want you to picture as if you are at the beach, and I want you to listen to the waves that are coming onto the sand or what we call the shore, okay? And I want you to picture yourself like sitting on the, gra on the sand and just un under the sun or maybe under an umbrella, okay? And you hear other people and other kids running and playing, maybe a dog barking, okay? And you hear the waves just coming and the water going back and coming and crashing against the rocks. And it's so peaceful, boys and girls, okay? So I want you to maybe picture yourself building a sandcastle and with your bucket and your little shovel you decide to go to where the water is coming at the edge and you decide to grab some water for your sandcastle okay and you're going to come back and you're going to build the tallest sandcastle okay and it's going to be really big and really huge with lots of towers okay and you're feeling really good about your sandcastle okay and your parents are so proud of you and they love it and these people that are coming by are watching you build it and they love seeing it too okay so right now I also want you to think about what else you do at the beach what is it what other fun things do you like to do do you like to uh, go swimming do you like to just go to the edge where the water comes and just wet your feet? Um, do you like to go searching for seashells, which is also something someone, people like to do all the time? Um, do you like to just take a walk with your parents or with your dog uh, up and down the beach? Or you could just want to sit down and just relax, maybe have a picnic. Okay, so I want you to think of all these things, boys and girls, that you would do at the beach if you went on a nice summer day or maybe on a day where it's not so hot, but the sun is out and it's a beautiful day. Okay, so think of that right now. Take a few seconds. Make sure you take some, some deep breaths. Blow out. Okay, just relax. All right. So hopefully you have some ideas and you had some pictures in your head. Okay, so now you can open up your eyes. Okay, now before your thoughts and memories leave your mind, we're going to put them down on paper. Okay, so we're going to create a thinking map. Okay, first. We're going to put our ideas on there, and then we're going to write a little story, okay? We're going to put all our ideas together, and we're going to write it down, okay? So, I would take a piece of paper. If you have some that doesn't have lines, that's good, okay? If you don't have any that um, doesn't look like this, it's okay. You can use line paper, okay? Now you're going to make your thinking map. So... 
if you have markers or you have crayons or colored pencils or a pencil, doesn't matter, take one. Messina is going to use her Sharpie, a black one, and you are going to draw your bubble mat. It's going to be a circle in the middle, okay, and you're going to make little lines all around, kind of like you're drawing a sun, okay. So here's my thinking map. Okay, now, what was the first thing that you thought of when you closed your eyes? Okay, so you're going to write that first idea down on any one of the lines. It doesn't matter. So Missy is going to take a different color, and I'm going to put my first idea. And I'm going to put, when I go to the beach, I like to look for seashells that's my favorite thing to do okay so I'm gonna put it there look for seashells okay oh in the middle boys and girls you're gonna put going to the beach okay in the middle of your circle going to the beach okay there you go going to the beach okay so put down a second idea boys and girls what else do you like to do at the beach so if you like to build sand castles you can put build sand castles okay so I'm gonna put relaxing I like to relax at the beach okay under my big umbrella Okay, so I'm putting relaxing. Okay, so I want you to put at least five things, okay, on your bubble map. Okay, if you want to add more, feel free to add more. Okay, so I'm going to use another color. Missing his favorite color is purple. So I'm going to write my third idea. And I'm going to put walk down the beach okay I just sometimes like to take a walk okay just to you know enjoy looking at the water enjoy you know just being peaceful smelling all the ocean air and maybe I see a few seashells and I pick them up so I like to take walks down the beach okay so I'm gonna put two more so another thing is I like to have picnics on the beach and I'm gonna put one more picnics was my fourth one so my last one let's see I'm going to put spend time with my family because when people go to the beach they usually go with their families right so we can just hang out and talk maybe play some games okay so here's mine boys and girls okay so I have five answers five ideas okay so I'm going to take these ideas and I'm going to put them together to write a little story okay so here I have some different paper I have lined paper so this is perfect to write your story okay so make sure you put your name at the top and put the date okay so kind of like right here name and date okay and you're gonna skip maybe two lines and go ahead and start your story now I would like you to write at least five sentences you're gonna write a sentence for each of the things you wrote in your bubble map okay so a sentence for this idea a sentence for this idea this one and so on okay so if you would like to write more like maybe six sentences or seven or maybe if you'd like to write half the page 
feel free to do it. Go ahead and start on that. Make sure your writing is neat as possible and keep writing on the lines, okay? Don't go writing down off the lines, okay? And when you're done with your story, you can show it to mom or dad, aunt or uncle, grandpa, or grandma, or older brother and sister, and you can have them read your story, okay? And then you can take it and put it up on your wall, in your room, or on the fridge, wherever, okay? So you guys have a great day, okay? Have fun, stay safe, keep washing those hands, keep staying healthy, okay? And I want to see you in a few weeks, okay? All right, boys and girls, bye!